So guys, here you can see I have a five ringtone. And now what I want here is that uh, I'm not able to play two audio at the same time. So if I play this and at the same time, if I try to play this, the previous should be paused, okay? So for this, we use a JavaScript to handle this. For now, if you like, if I play this and if I play this, <laughs> both are played, right? So we should stop uh, the previous one. So let's use JavaScript. So it's a little bit tricky to use this. So here I'll do it. So here I'll make the on play and then here we'll have a function and I'll write pause others o t s e r pause others and this. So this will be the event and here we'll make the pause others. I'll copy this and here is script and here will be our function and the function is punch others and here we we'll have limit and we have the audio so dollar audio a u d i o audio not element element and then we'll loop each as and here we'll have the function and we'll have index with the key and the value is the audio and close here and then we'll write the audio points here so now this should work so let's try this so we should not be able to play two audio at some time so if i play this and try to play <laughs> then this is now you can see points so if I play this and try to play, then this is also. So it's working perfectly, okay? So now what I like to do is, I like to cut this code from here and I'll paste in a layouts.app here so that uh, it will be available everywhere whenever I, I use the audio tag. So here is the JavaScript code and I'll put here and it should still work, so let's try. So this one and this one yeah, is still working. So now one more thing is that we completed all the functionality of the ringtone. Now here I want to display the uh, ringtone uh, so that we can use admin and click and can view all the ringtones here. Okay, so let's see that. So let's go to layouts and here in the authenticator section. So so if user is authenticated and uh, it's here I think. Uh, so this is for guest and this is mm, this is for guest and here is the for user and here I can check easily so authenticated links here I'll check what I do is if auth auth check that means if user is logged in then here I'll write in if and then I'll copy this and paste over here. I'll paste here and here I'll write ringtones, arrange right, ring tones. All right, manage ringtones. Yeah, manage manage ringtone. Manage ringtones and the route will be the ringtone r i n g ringtones dot index and now let's see this so if i do then i don't see anything because i am not logged in so let me logged in as an admin so i'll log in as an admin and my admin username and passport is uh, i can see here so if i go down then this is the username for the admin and here I'll go here and I'll paste here and my passport is the passport one two three so I'll copy this and I'll paste over here so let me log in now so now I'm logged in and you can see minus passport minus ringtones and if I click then I come to the index of this now one more thing I like to do here before we finish this video here I like to use the middleware auth M I D D middleware auth so that only authenticated user can land to this page 
can access all routes here okay so now if I do here then I still see this and if I like log out and if I try to go to the ringtones then I should be authenticated user so great so now I'll see you in the next video